Mr. 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 Way on that particular point, and he will know that I'm very concerned about Lynham. While, of course, I accept what he says, I quite understand that, uh, of course, government departments are answerable for their decisions. Does he not accept that those communities that live round bases at the moment have given their wholehearted support to the base, and therefore it's unreasonable that the Minister of Defence, not other government departments, the Minister of Defence should be ready to say what they believe the economic consequences of a base closure will be and what they will do to support the communities thereafter? Well, my honourable friend is allowing himself to go into the realms of speculation. We will have to uh, await the decisions. Obviously, with regard to RAF Lynham, he has known what has been in the pipeline for quite some time. And, of course, there are economic consequences of any decisions um, that are taken. But uh, I think he just has to uh, keep his powder dry and, and see what exactly gets decided uh, about Lynham uh, as other members will have to about those bases or those industrial issues um, which they hold most dear. As I say.